Hi everyone, welcome back. My name is Lydia Ifinio. Welcome to my channel. Today, guys, I will show you how I make this very nice, easy to do using only drugstore um, eye palettes. I look. I do kind of quite often to brighten up my eyes and my eyes look a little bit more open and brighter and because I have a hooded eyes and a deep set eyes and if you're interested how I achieve this look please keep watching. I have a makeup on my face already. I have nothing on my eyes except a bit of concealer in the corners which is my Glossier stretch concealer and all the products which I'm wearing I will link in the description box and I will do the makeup on my eyes with this palette. It's uh, Revolution Makeup um, Redemption Palette Essential Mats 2 and this is quite you know I think it's in a cool tone palette which have this beautiful kind of cool tones. I will mattify my eyelids with whatever I have left over on my brush, which is like a powder which I use today. Just have it slightly like, that's it. And then I will start with this color, which is quite bright. I'm gonna brighten my whole eye area on, on my eyelids up to my uh, brow bone. And I'm gonna use the first color, which is this one. And I'm using for that like kind of fluffy brush to just kind of lightly wash off the color. Just gently. I'm gonna do the same. It's gonna be very quick, very easy to kind of make my eyes a little bit more pop, look less hooded. Now I'm gonna use slightly smaller brush and I'm gonna go with this color. It's this one. I think the colors in the palette look different than in the camera than in the real life. It's like a fourth from the, the lightest shade. And I'm gonna go in the slightly above the crease. And I'm gonna do a little bit of wash off with slightly smaller brush. I'm gonna do the same on the other eye. Just look at that. More around just above the crease. I'm gonna use the next one to it. It's gonna be kind of movie colors today. It's gonna be this one, and I'm gonna use this in the outer corners of my eyes and just in the end of my eye and slightly above just on my, the hooded path, like on the brow bone in here. I'm gonna do the same with the other eye. I really like this palette, it's quite, it's very good, I think, for kind of blue eyes, Gonna your eye will pop more the color with this kind of movie pinkish shades. I'm using all this everything with the one brush because I'm using going from the lightest shades till the darkest shades. I'm not gonna use very dark, but we're gonna go slightly darker. I'm gonna go this color now, this slightly like a light bronze. I'm gonna use just in the corners of my eyes, just in here. Just have a little bit of more in there. Just very gently. And slightly above the crease. I'm gonna go the same color with this brown color here, which I'm using in the outer corners. I'm gonna use this slightly underneath my oof, my eyes, just very gently, just outer corners. I'm 
Now I'm gonna blend everything with this slightly lighter shade because between the mauve and the darker brown which I'm used at the moment I'm gonna go above the crease and I'm gonna literally everything blends around in my crease just all a little bit out the corners and the same with this eye This my this eye is much easier for me to do my makeup because I have a little bit still is in still is crease, still have a hood, but it's kind of more even. I think I have a more space because this one have this kind of darker shade is difficult for me to do my makeup. I always find this kind of difficult, but this is what I need to work with my eyes like that. And I'm gonna go as well underneath it a bit more, smudge this color, make it much lighter. The same here. Then I'm gonna go with a little bit of shimmer and I'm gonna use for that another drugstore um, eyeshadow palette which is this one from uh, Wet n Wild. I'll make a video on the review on Wet n Wild um, eyeshadow palettes and this one color is in Peta Patalette or something like that and I'm gonna use this in the just center of my eyelid. This one is palette not really amazing but I really like this color and it's really nice kind of pinkish lavender color it's really really beautiful and it's not a very crazy shimmer corner of my eyes I'm gonna use this smaller like a slightly dense brush this lighter color is slightly shimmer in it I have to be very careful because it's very very pigmented but it's very also leave it lots of residue under your eyes when you're doing the makeup so i always take it off back of my hands to kind of i don't want any shimmer around my lids and, up and around my on the eye area actually it's not very good with the brush these eyeshadows are not very great to be honest with you <laughs> let me have a little bit of that it's much better Just brightening the corners of my eyes and then have a little bit more blend everything together and then I'm gonna put some mascara on which is my favorite always um, volume million lash mascara from L'Oreal and I absolutely love it special for daytime it's like my everyday mascara eye brightening makeup to make your eyes look much brighter thank you very much for watching i hope you like this quick video and if you like it please give it a thumbs up and i will see you in my next one bye